All right, I have uh, some boards loaded up. I have a, uh, a MAR-1, a MAR-4, a MAR-6, and a MAR-8. So uh, they came out real good. Um, we will hook them up and see what we see, okay? All right, let's see here. Let's, uh, let's see here. Let's turn this around. We'll start out with the MAR-1. And we're going to run all of these at 12 volts. All right, there we go. Where's our power? Here's our power. We will hook up. We will hook up 12 volts. Oh, and there we go. We're getting 17.7 uh, dB of gain. I think that's exactly data sheet. Um, so yeah, let's see here. Mar one data sheet is 17.8 dB. And yeah, we're right on, right on data sheet. And, uh, these things are good to one gig. Yeah. One gigahertz. Okay. So let's set a marker, a marker at, uh, one gigahertz. So yeah, there we are. All right. Looking good. And let's check the. Uh, return loss and okay so it's uh, let's see here it's doing let's see here marker two um, so it's doing really good out here to around 900 megahertz and then it kind of falls off after that oh there we go okay so um, Let's see, let's just, well, yeah, this is going to be complicated. Let me just set the frequency stop at one gigahertz and then we don't have to worry about all of the markers and stuff. There we go. Let me just tear it, turn the markers off, all off. Okay. So there we go. So it's doing pretty good right up to the very end. And then the, uh, gain, there's the gain looks very, very nice out to a gigahertz. All right. Falls off two dB. Very nice, very nice. Okay, that was MAR1, and MAR4 will be the next one. I remember MAR4s were the one that were marked yellow or something? I don't know, it was weird. I don't know really what that meant. All right, let's get power on this one. And, oh, well, that doesn't look good. We only have about, uh, about 8 dB of gain. Let's check the, uh, let's check the MAR4 data sheet. Uh, MAR4 data sheet says gain of 8. All right, 8.3. And that's about where we are. So very nice. Okay. So why do you have such a low gain on these guys? Uh, I don't know. I don't know why each one of the Mars was invented, but uh, this one has a low gain. Okay, sometimes, I guess sometimes you don't want a little hard, high gain, right? We'll go to Mars 6 next. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to check the uh, return loss on this one. Let's put it back. Let's put it back. All right, return loss. Ooh, wow, maybe that's why. Really, really good return loss. Very good matching. All right, so let's go to MAR6. Oops, I'm hooking it up backwards. That wouldn't be good. That wouldn't be good. And let's see, go back to transmission. Let's hook up power. And this one looks like it's got about 19 dB of gain. Okay. What's Mars 6 data sheet say? It says 21 dB. A little bit under, about 19. It's supposed to be 21. So this one's just a little bit under. And what does its return loss look like? Very good, except for the very end. So a lot like the Mars 1. Okay. 
And then Mar 8 is the last one. I don't know if Mar 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I don't know if they were done chronologically that way. Like, is Mar 8 a newer part? I don't know. I don't know why there are so many that are almost the same. If somebody knows, comment below. All right. Let's go here to Mar 8. Put some power on him. Oh, very nice. Uh, he's got some wigglies on him. But we're up here around 25 dB of gain. All right, what does the Mar 8 data sheet say? My, it says 31 dB. This one's way low for what it should be. 31 dB, hmm. Now what's the return loss look like? Oh, looks terrible. Hmm. Maybe there's something wrong for the on the PC board. Yeah, there must be something wrong. This one just doesn't look right. Let me let me look at the PC board. All right, I'm going to uh, put a new part on here. Remove the old part, and uh, let's see if I can't put on a new part. Well, seems like it does the same thing. Um, something's des desperately wrong here, and I don't know what. Uh, we're getting 26 dB of gain out of it, but the, uh, the input viz is just atrocious. What does it say about the Mar 8 here? Yeah, it says match to 50 ohms. Um, Got the right resistor in it. Let me let me turn up the voltage a bit and see if uh, see if it gets better. Maybe the data sheet's wrong. Yeah, see, there we go. So if I put in more current and take it up to say 30 dB of gain, and then we'll look at the reflection. Yeah, is it better? I don't think so. Let's. Uh, Oh yeah, go up in power, let's see. I'll go up in voltage here, it's starting to swirl in. I'm at 15 volts now. I don't know, maybe I've got the wrong data sheet for this part. Um, yeah, anyway, if anybody knows why my eight is weird, all the other ones worked out just fine and this one is just bizarre. And uh, I don't know. Okay, well, there you go. That was a very long chip of the day. Uh, <laughs> we went from looking at the parts to putting them on a board I found online to designing my own board and then trying out all the different varieties and stuff. So, yeah, anyway, uh, hope you learned something. I'll put the boards on uh, the PCB Way share site and uh, you can grab the uh, footprints and stuff from there or whatever you want to do.